and the Macomb County Sheriff's Office is investigating a heinous case of animal abuse in Ray Township. Their evidence includes a YouTube video of a German Shepherd being slammed and choked by its owner. Police believe the man responsible is a local veterinarian. 7 Action News reporter Alex Bozarjin joining us from the Macomb Humane Society with more. The dog's body language in that video is really what's most shocking and disturbing. Animals with those same fear behaviors come into Macomb Humane all of the time. And that history of abuse often makes it really difficult for them to have a normal life. Get over here! A man police have yet to name lashes out at a dog that is said to be his own. He stalks the dog through the house. You can see the German Shepherd trembling with fear. The rest of the video is too disturbing to show. You live close by to Ray Township. I mean, what was your immediate reaction to seeing something so horrible like that? It was just sickening because you could tell the dog's body language and you could just see the dog was scared and nervous. Arielle Johns knows that fearful wince all too well. In 2020, she took in Luca, a stray from Pontiac with a history of abuse. After a year in their care, Luca was put down, his trauma making it impossible for him to thrive. We took him to specialists and doctors and we were trying so hard to fix him. And ultimately at the end, mentally, he just couldn't handle the world anymore. Johns thinks of Luca when she sees this video. The Macomb County Sheriff's Office says the man in question is a local veterinarian. Two other dogs were also living in the home. Uh, we have these animals back. We're going to be making sure that we're taking care of uh, watching where this goes to make sure somebody's held accountable for their actions. The man has not been charged and police didn't say where he's currently practicing. Investigators think the animal abuse may just be part of the story. You wonder if that is something that might even be happening with some of the, uh, the other people inside that home. So it is something we're alerted to um, and uh, there's going to be part of that investigation as it continues. According to MSP's Michigan Incident Crime Report, animal cruelty crimes grew around 100 cases each year from 2016 to 2018. Michigan Humane says they investigate more than 5,000 animal cruelty complaints each year in Detroit, Hamtramck, and Highland Park. We're supposed to be their voice and we're supposed to help them and protect them. And for somebody to do that to a dog in the presence of kids, it's just so disheartening. Attorney General Dana Nessel will be visiting Detroit tomorrow to announce a partnership with Michigan Humane to investigate and prosecute crimes like this one. If you ever see animal abuse, don't hesitate to reach out to police. In Macomb County, I'm Alex Bozargian for 7 Action News.